volcanic tectonic tremors, which indicate the movement of magma, were recorded on the quake hit Azores Island in the mid-Atlantic of Sao Jorge for the first time since the alarming seismic crisis began more than two weeks ago, authorities say. The lush green volcanic island in Portugal's Azores archipelago has been hit by 27,626 minor tremors and there are fears the activity could trigger an eruption or a strong earthquake. Fatima Viveiros of the region Savaiza Seismovolcanic Monitoring Center said volcanic tectonic earthquakes, also known as hybrids, occur when there is a fusion of high-frequency tectonic vibrations with low-frequency volcanic tremors. This indicates fluid movement at depth, Viveiros explained, adding that more such earthquakes are expected. These signals indicate what to expect in an active volcanic system. The volcano warning is at level 4 on a 5-step scale, meaning there is a real chance the volcano could erupt for the first time since 1808. A 2015 study published in the Journal of Volcanology and Geothermal Research says volcanic tectonic earthquakes are typically the earliest reported seismic precursors to eruptions at volcanoes that have been dormant for decades or more. Savaiza said an eruption was not imminent, but said such a scenario could not be ignored. So far, all recorded earthquakes are purely tectonic and not volcanic tectonic like Wednesday's earthquake, which reached a magnitude of up to 3.8 and caused no damage. According to the United States Geological Survey, volcanic tectonic earthquakes can occur due to normal tectonic forces, pressure changes caused by magma movement and fluid movement through pre-existing cracks. The Azores Contingency Plan was activated on March 23rd, for days after the seismic crisis began, an evacuation strategy had been put in place if needed, and various resources had been deployed to the island.